And with that, everybody, now it's time for our featured story of the night. It's time for some Ninja Turtles. <laughs> yep, that's what I'm diving in. We got, we got the serious, we got the fun. So I'm going to dive into <laughs> Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Mutant Mayhem, everybody. This is coming out this summer, August. Uh, August, shame, my, my notes that was so small today. August 4th. And let me get into this. So the Ninja Turtles are coming back. That's right. Seth Rogen's movie. Seth Rogen's producing this, creating this. Bringing it out, it's an animated movie now, everybody. Jackie Chan is Splinter. That's right. Oh, and they have, yeah. te- and they actually have kids playing the Ninja Turtles. This is the first time we have actual like teenagers playing the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Eating Shocker! Pizza, eating pizza, smoking weed in the sewer. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> you got Hannibal Burgess is playing uh, Genghis Frog. You got John Cena as Rocksteady. You got Seth Rogen as Bebop. Yeah. You got Ice Cube as Superfly. You got, uh, who else we got here? We got Paul Rudd as Mongo Gecko. We got Maya Rudolph as Cynthia Ultram. I mean, they have a lot. There's some names I don't know yet. August 4th, this is coming out. But after years of being sheltered from the human world, the Turtle Brothers set out to win the hearts of New Yorkers and be accepted as normal teenagers through heroic, heroic acts. Heroic acts. Mm. This is what the synopsis is saying. So they're coming out of the sewer and they're coming back and they're going to be winning your hearts in Ninja Turtle theaters moving forward this summer. In Ninja so, Turtle theaters? <laughs> in Ninja Turtle theaters. theaters. Yes, specially cool. themed theaters. Cool. I saw this, and it's, it's a big switch because you have them, like I said, actually being Ninja Turtles teenagers. And uh, it's the CGI kind of looks like Into the Spider-Verse, which I think is fun. I think that's a lot of fun. Uh, GR says, no way. I don't think he's about this. You know, like GR is about this. He's like, no, don't give me any more Ninja Turtles. Uh, I mean, I was a, I had turtle power as a kid. I had the turtle blimp. I had the turtle van. I have a chest at my mom and dad's house full of Ninja Turtles. You know, I have all of it at the sewer set. I mean, I love the Ninja Turtles. Like, I, I, I'm a TMNT power boy, man. That's me. I, I had, I had one of, the, I had one of the sets where like it had the ooze and you could dip oh. them into the ooze. But like, there's yeah. a very nice. limited amount of ooze that you can actually use if you want <laughs> to. Why, why be a stingy the about the ooze? You know, <laughs> but that's, that's, yeah, just, that's just my nature, man. <laughs> like, why are you holding back careful. on the ooze? So because I want, because I want, I want to be able to use it again in the future. You gotta say, you gotta save that. <laughs> I, might, I might need it later, Brian. Is the real answer. <laughs> <laughs> you might need that <laughs> ooze for something else. Yeah. Mike, you saw this. You saw the trailer, right? Did you did you like it? Are you excited about this? Does it hit this time, or do you think this is a bad choice? This is great, man. They've been they've been hitting solid on on all these animated features. Like a bunch of them have been halfway decent. The ones that I have seen, like I'm I I think it's pretty cool that Seth Rogen, uh, who's like, by the way, like he's a massive weed distributor and he's presenting at the at the Nickelodeon. Uh, <laughs> he did he was he was talking trash about the sports? cw that's so interesting to me like that that we can have that big of a shift in our society like um but it, it's cool it's cool that he that like i i imagine that that audience really appreciated he said the turtles are coming back or he probably said mm-hmm. <laughs> the turtles are coming Tur- back turtles <laughs> i can see him playing uh bebop that's for sure uh, you know i can see yeah. him playing bebop uh, no, it's, it's yeah. gonna be great. There's gonna be more cartoons. What there was just there was just the Shredder, um, the Shredder, uh, Brawler 2D thing that was released on all the platformers. I didn't I don't know if you played that at all, Brian. I didn't play it. Was it was it good? Yeah, it was it was freaking great. It was just like a Turtles in Time arcade. Like I love uh, Turtles in Time. It's such a great game. Yeah, I, th- I think it's the, such a I great think game. The Turtles are just a, a timeless series, uh, and I'm pretty much gonna be on board with them just be, just because it's silliness so anytime you're injecting that level of silliness even though it's marketing just to sell toys at least it's it's goofy kid stuff like eat some pizza cowabunga let's Dude. donatello fix <laughs> fix some fix machines, some shit fix you some know machines, oh yeah be, be leaders and also raf like be a little cranky at our parents. I, guess. <laughs> like, I love the the exchange at the end of the, the trailer point. where they're talking about they call it ooze. She's like, she said someone's like, no ooze, 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 ooze. And they're having fun with it. It's fun, you know. It's it's leaning into the teenage aspect, which I think is great. 
Jake, you saw the you saw the trailer. What do you think? Are you excited about this? Is this something that you would take your daughter to, or are you like this is not for me? Uh, I it's uh, I'm excited about it. I'm gonna watch it before I let her see it. You <laughs> That's know, smart. It's, That's probably it's a good call. A good, I think it's a solid move. Um, I don't know. My first exposure to the turtles was my brother explaining how uh, who was it wasn't Shredder was the teacher Krang. Right. Oh, you Splinter. Splinter, you're talking about. Splinter was the teacher. Shredder Jackie was Chan. The guy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, well, he got killed in a, the back of a garbage truck. Is that how they got rid of him? Oh, Shredder got killed yep. in the back yep. of they a garbage threw truck. Yeah. They threw him off the building into the garbage truck. Into the garbage truck. Yeah. Yes. And that was like my first exposure. I was like, that's an interesting way to do that. You know? <laughs> so I'm excited. Turtles. Yeah, think, Turtles is cool. Yeah. Turtles. So, and you know charlie's really into she loves monday night raw she like laughs she nice. thinks Which it's is awesome, awesome. <laughs> so yeah she's always asking for when the people throw each other like that's what she calls it so, <laughs> so, so yeah i think i'll watch it and then we'll probably check it out together if there's bodies flying we'll have fun Papa, if it's papa, papa, when are papa. the people throwing each other again <laughs> Not, the people throw each other yeah that's exactly how it goes I'm like, we gotta if wait till Monday night. We can watch it. If it's anything like the uh like the into the spider verse stuff, like the, the animation looks cool. Yeah, GR looks says Cowabunga yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah Cowabunga oh, yeah. dude. If it's if it's anything like that, and, and Seth Rogen apparently is a big Turtles fan and he's doing it. So you know he, he, Yeah, which hopefully having a fan do it will make it even better, yeah. you know. Well, dude, I think he's, it will. He's, got, he's got a thousand friggin' comic book properties under his belt now, so I can't imagine that he's gonna be I, I bet I bet he'll actually put in some input as a producer rather than just saying, "Okay, we'll put out a new line of toys." Like, we'll just he'll, yeah. he'll probably at least read the script and go, "Ha ha, this is funny!" Like, this is stupid. <laughs> he'll cross it out and write some notes, which will make it a lot better, I would imagine. Like, he cares. Yeah. I, I gotta I gotta believe. He's got a great cast too. So, and the kids are all pretty much no names, which is great too. You know, give some kids yeah. some opportunity, yeah. throw them in there. And I was I was skeptical at first, but when I heard their voices and them playing, I'm like, this this is great. This is fun. You know, I think it's gonna be a fresh breath of air for the whole franchise. And hopefully, it does well. They did the animated ones before, and it didn't. You know, it did all right, but it wasn't like this. You know, the first one it didn't hit. They did one animated one, and then they went back to making them CG with real life, which. You know, it was okay. You know, it was okay though. They had two of those. It was all right. But this the, looks the like Michael, it's more the Michael Bay ones. Yeah, they're all right. You know. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. I'm <laughs> not, not so saying much. they were masterpieces, <laughs> man. I'm saying eh, it was something. You know, they happened. They happened. You know, and uh, they tried something, and it didn't really hit hard. You know, that's just what it was. So this looks like it's more back to its roots, more back to the soul of Ninja Turtles, and. You know, I'm, I'm all for it. I'll check it out. August 4th, everybody. You're in, if you're into turtle power, August 4th, turtles are coming back. T-U-R-T-L-E power. Power. <laughs> On the half shell. Yep. Ninja. Ninja. Rap. Ninja.